CBS 42 News. Oh, coming up, we're going to get a little more rain, Mark. Yeah, we're actually on track to get a few light sprinkles tonight. Had a little bit of rain here atop the studio. Hey, look, it sneaks in every now and then, but we've got a lot to talk about. Right now, the current temperatures across the area with clouds in place. In downtown Birmingham, just got that brief sprinkle, 69. Cloudy, winds out of the north. That will be uh, shifting, actually, as we get a little later into the evening, but 62 in Anniston, so it's a little cooler for those of you in Calhoun County. And those uh, returns, which are popping up now across St. Clair, Jefferson, back into Etowah counties, light rain that is now just starting to squeeze together. Not a whole lot here, and some of this likely not reaching the ground, but that will continue to track towards the north and east. Now, it's a different story to the north. We've got rain across the Ohio Valley, but out towards the west, there is cold air which has moved in, and there is a major ice storm in the making. It's beginning today, but it will continue for tomorrow into Sunday. So if you have travel plans, especially anywhere from Oklahoma back up towards St. Louis, right through Nebraska, Kansas, these are areas that you need to check your travel plans ahead of time because some spots could get up to up to an inch. I mean, we're talking an inch of ice that will be crippling. Travel will be shut down, basically. Temperatures across our area, no problems with ice here. And as I mentioned, all that colder air, it's just to the north of us, but this chunk of air sitting right here is not budging. It won't move out of the way, so that cold air can't get into Alabama. And even though we will see a passing shower as we get into the first of next week, it'll be later into next week before some of this starts to arrive in our area. Here's your storm track future cast for the rest of tonight into early tomorrow morning. Clouds still in place, little drizzle, light rain. Had a report uh, earlier from Hamilton where it was raining a pretty decent amount throughout the afternoon, and that has now since tracked off, but we'll see throughout Saturday. Some sunshine gets in here, and we could be breaking or tying records again like we did today. Tied a record not only in Anniston, but also broke one in Birmingham, and it was 81 degrees down in Montgomery. Now, for those of you hunting, I did want to uh, point out that we are going to see very warm conditions. Winds out of the south, keep that in mind, but there is just not a whole lot in the way of a break from the very mild temperatures we have in place. And the chance of rain, it continues to go up by Tuesday and Wednesday. And then next Thursday and Friday, we'll have another round of showers. But the air, it's not going to be that cold like it should.